The biggest argument against voting in the church, aside from the fact that voting in the church is sort of not exactly from the Bible, okay, um, uh, for women voting in the church, the biggest argument is, okay, so you, you once had one vote for every family, and now you have two votes for every family, and it's okay for the woman and the husband to disagree about the future publicly. Privately, publicly, publicly, privately, okay? That's the problem. That's the, I mean, who cares about the vote? I mean, the, the idea that voting's a right or a duty or any of these things this is a man-made concept. Okay, so you can it has some value like the strengths finder or whatever, right? But like, the bigger issue is like, why would you, as a couple who's married, to stay married together for the sake of your life together in faith, go to a congregation and want a different future from each other there? That just allows it encourages division in the home to remain division in the home. And become part of division in the church. That seems unwise, right? Um, does that mean that women shouldn't vote? I mean, again, I think it's a red herring. Actually, um, you take away the, the the women's right to vote in the church, and it it doesn't change the problems we're facing right now with birth control, or the lack of value of family, or the. Um, you see, Paul has this old phrase. It's kind of rough. First Corinthians fourteen. They should be silent. He says, right? So, so you you in some church bodies. You can't vote, but you can you can speak out against your pastor publicly and disagree with him about theology in front of a whole group of people. That seems to me to be a bigger issue. Biblically, call me nuts, I am, you know, but it, I believe what it says. That's the, that's why I'm crazy. Is I believe what the Bible says, right? And do I think that they should be silent in the churches means that women can't ask a question in Bible study? Not necessarily. However, I also do think that it'd be amazing if they did ask their husbands at home. Like Paul said, like that'd be incredible. And then her husband came back. He's like, you know, last week after Bible study, my wife asked me this question and I, I didn't know the answer. Can you know, the, like what an amazing community that would be. 